In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you things I wish I knew before starting YouTube. So if you're looking out for how to start up a YouTube channel or you have started already but along the line you wish you knew some certain kind of thing, I think this my video will actually help you. Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. It's Vibe Sonia and I'm back again with another mind-blowing video. How are you guys doing? Hope you guys are fine. Hope you guys are good. If this is the first time tuning in, do what subscribe, like this video, drop me your comment and lastly, do not forget to share for every other person to get this good news. So yes, with no further ado, let us dive right into this video. The first thing I wish I knew before starting YouTube is my intro video. If I knew that my intro videos were not necessarily important, were too long sometimes, I wouldn't have even gone into all of that. Yes. If you check my videos back then when i started whenever i want to do intro i tend to blab a lot and at the end of the day i am not even getting the views i desire to get yes so my intros was one of the things i wish i knew that if you want your intros to be really catchy and you want your audience to like stick to what you are watching your intro needs to be quick okay so my intro is number one thing i wish i knew better the second thing i wish i knew before starting youtube is people are not going to view as you desire i remember starting up youtube and i was just so worried about people are not watching my videos to the point i will send them to my social media platforms like my instagram my tiktok my whatsapp and it still comes back with low view and at some point i got discouraged i was asking myself should i quit youtube should i not quit youtube not knowing that there is no successful youtuber that started on youtube that has not gone through this get me one of the successful youtubers that posted their first video on youtube without them having anybody here to shout them out without them just with them just coming here and they succeed so if i knew that i was not even supposed to bother about my views i think i would have done better on youtube because that alone lagged me off to do a lot of things like not posting as i am supposed to post and sometimes even when i get my phone to like check my views and worry about my subscribers I just get discouraged at the end of the day the third thing i wish i knew before starting up a youtube channel is it is not a quick making money skill when i started youtube i started with all of these i must make money my main aim of coming to youtube is making money and when it goes to the first second third year of me not making money on youtube i became really really sad and at some point i became really really faint-hearted that i actually wanted to give up see if you're starting up youtube out there just know that for you to be able to make money you need to put in the work okay when it comes to your filming your editing your posting and every other stuff that we do with youtube youtube is not a quick money making skills with youtube is a place that you can develop your creativity and then turn your those your creativities into monetization and making money out of it so if i knew all of that i think i would have been more patient to do my research very well because all what i was having that time on my head is i want to make money and i must make money with youtube and when the money was not forthcoming especially at the point of me getting monetized and at the end of the day my monetization money was just counting tippers my heart fainted okay it took me extra six months for me to be able to get a tippers out of youtube youtube so this is to tell you that if you are there and you have started your youtube channel you need to be more patient because youtube is not a make money quick scheme youtube is a place whereby you need to calm yourself down invest your creativities invest in what you need to invest into for your channel to be able to stand out there the fourth thing i wish i knew before starting up a youtube channel is consistency when i started my youtube channel i was not all about consistency i was just posting like twice some weeks i don't even post at all some weeks i post once okay i didn't really know that i need to be more consistent here for my videos to be visible out there be it with views or without views i just need to do what i needed to do best so i was just everywhere okay and to be honest if you're everywhere on youtube at the end of the day you're not going to get what you are supposed to get you can fall back to my old videos and trust me you are going to know that i just make a joke out of myself okay if i knew that consistency would actually be a big spike for my channel i would have started by uploading every day on youtube okay as at that point when i see people uploading every day on youtube i'd be like are those people serious but honestly when i started my consistency life i've seen a lot of improvements and i'm so happy and i'm so grateful to god for that the next thing i wish i knew about youtube starting up youtube channel is people don't care about your fancy equipment 
your fancy apartment, what you wear or whatever you choose to do on YouTube. Starting up a YouTube channel, my greatest fear was, oh, I don't have this, I don't have that, I don't have this, I don't have that. Seeing myself competing with other YouTubers, it's something that really weighed me down because at the end of the day, I noticed that nobody even give a them about what you care. I remember that time before I'll be able to come and sit down to film one video is either I'm wearing a very fancy, beautiful top or I am not doing at all. And that thing was one of the things that actually dragged me back. But just check out the videos that I've been uploading within how many period from starting from last month to this month i just wear one black polo to do that and that video is also able to get that good visibility so if i know that getting all of these fancy things will actually not be a plus or minus what people just need out there is what you are going to feed them with and then make them to stay and subscribe to your channel i wouldn't have been going into all of that stress so for those of you watching me if you're thinking of getting all of that fancy equipment fancy hair fancy home fancy clothes before you start up your youtube channel Channel, you're actually doing the wrong thing because actually nobody cares about you nobody cares about what you wear nobody cares about what you eat nobody cares about how your apartment is nobody cares about anything about you the only thing is do what you know can bring value to the community and at the end of the day you are going to be making it here on YouTube the next thing I regretted or I wish I knew before starting YouTube is niching down okay that is one of my regrets when i started youtube i i niche down yes i niche down to lifestyle check back to my videos you see that most of the content i created there was just lifestyle 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 not knowing that at the initial period people will really not care about my lifestyle i'm not saying you that is doing lifestyle out there is not okay it is okay okay if you feel like your lifestyle is good enough but for my own end if i knew i would have imputed more of this my youtube journey tutorials or impute more of my apps that are making money because as i when i started youtube i already started making money from some apps i think it would have been more good head for me than now i think my subscribers count would have been more than where i am today okay so starting up a youtube channel the first thing you need to do is to place your hand and try what you feel can actually work for you so if i would have tried more things then i think i would have been doing better as at this point of my life the next thing i wish i knew about youtube before starting youtube is checking my youtube studio analysis to know what and what's best to work for me because i just go ahead and create videos that at the end of the day my audience are not even loving what i am creating at the end of the Day, my audience are not even paid attention i never paid attention to comments i never paid attention to which videos is actually doing well for me which videos do i need to focus on i just come here and put anything that i wish to put without checking my analytics gradually as a new youtuber i don't want you to have any of that regret if you're not good with checking out your analytics please start doing all of that pay attention to your audience pay attention to their comments respond to their comments so that at the end of the day you are going to know which particular niche you really need to focus on next thing i wish i knew before starting youtube channel is not making enough research yes i just bumped into youtube because i saw my beautiful dana equipment said she become a millionaire youtuber and when i saw that video the only thing that just stuck into my head is i want to be a millionaire youtuber as well and i did not make enough research i was supposed to make some of my videos were just flaunt some of my um description were just nothing to write home about so in fact you <laughs> god it was a whole lot so if i knew knew that starting up a youtube channel would take a lot from me i would have been able to do more of research to know what will actually work for me and how i will actually go about that there is a whole lot of difference between this my channel and my second channel okay i started on my second channel with tutorials and when i mean tutorials that channel did very well as at this point of me talking to you that channel has over 5,000 subscribers and of which this channel was not successful when this channel was at that point or at that level okay so if i knew i would have do more of my research to know what will actually work for me to know what kind of stuff i'm supposed to upload here to know what kind of value i'm supposed to put out here for me to be able to get all of my success achieved so if you're watching me and you've not put any of this thing that i've said into consideration you are wrong if you're a youtuber and you started making money on youtube let me know in the comment section what you wish you knew before starting youtube another thing that i wish i knew is not saying oh youtube is all that simple and easy i will just go there post a video and people will actually watch to be honest it is not easy yes youtube is not easy youtube is not easy at all you need to put in the hard work for you to be able to get anything you want to get from this place 
so that is it guys thank you so much for staying stick and hook me to the end of this video i want to know your thoughts in the comment section what do you think you wish what do you wish you knew before starting youtube it's just going to be a lot of privilege for me to also hear from your own points of view and yes if you've not subscribed please do what subscribe like this video drop me your comment and lastly do not forget to share and with no further ado i do add like always in my videos i'm going to be saying bye and i'll see you guys in my next one for now bye i love you guys Mwah.